Welcome back everybody. This is Kinema and we're here with some more Minecraft Unity SMP. So, uh, you may notice something first off. And I'm not wearing any armor. That's because I wanted to AFK all day and I did AFK all day because I was lazy. Um, my gold farm. Uh, I made it to AFK, which I did. And you may notice something. Take you a wild guess. There's 264 somethings that I need to do something with. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I don't even know if I have enough lapis for this. So basically, I went to work at. I logged into the server. I went ahead and jumped in my minecart. Got all. Got rid of all. Ever my full inventory just in case. And figured I just AFK. You know, see, see what I could possibly do for, um, I got tons of leather. See what I could get. You know, I was kind of curious on, because last time I, uh, I over, I AFK'd overnight. I really didn't, um, <laughs> hijack some, uh, some sugar cane. Actually, I think I have a bunch actually so um there's no way i'm gonna have enough storage for all these books um so basically i went ahead and where am i going went ahead and afk'd back and forth i i like i was saying i <laughs> getting tongue-tied um afk'd one day and really wasn't the results that I was expecting so um, yeah so basically I went ahead and that was about a six hour time period and yeah but I ended up with I was stopped on the track so I'm not sure exactly why I slowed down and stopped but I did um, barely had a full chest of nuggets um, I was like oh oh well I was like okay well at least it works you know I, I can't say much and you know, I wasn't there and I just got stuff in the chat so so I AFK today to find out exactly how well it would do came home and I was still going back and forth and then I looked down at my levels 264 uh, <laughs> it worked very well as you can tell and I made almost four blocks I think I had three full stacks um, and about 55 or 60 ish close to 60 um, blocks on a fourth stack so that's not bad considering at one point my sorting system and my farm broke probably because the chests were just getting too full now, I do have an overflow to prevent some of that but yeah so I mean I really just can't complain. I mean, that is just tons and tons of uh, gold for, you know, being at work. So uh, that is awesome. So sharpness three, I will take it like back for the following. I will take smite four, efficiency four. Sounds good to me. Fortune 2, I will take Fortune 2. Efficiency 3, I uh, will take it. <laughs> Not like I need to do any of this. I really don't want to bane. Uh, I'll take it. Seriously? Fortune 2, that works. And then I, oh, that. Microfinity power three, a lot of stuff. Feather falling four. I will take feather falling four. And we're not even below two hundred levels yet. <laughs> so this is not what I had planned all day. Um, I will take a soap touch boat. That's for sure. Ooh, projection. I'll take depth strider. Actually, I guess I need to start looking at that. Oh. Infinity one on that knockback. I like that. Uh, yeah, I'll do that. T 
Protection four. Oh yeah, that should have been no brainer. Aqua Infinity. Already used. Look at how much lapis already used. Aqua Infinity. Power four. Infinity one. Sounds good to me. So this is not what I, exactly what I had planned for this episode. Um, I will have to figure out because this is full. Um, so much from my sorting system. I'll just have to look through the books and sort them out. What I'll probably end up doing is doing like you know, power bows or some, or, you know, add more chest, which I will have to expand. And I'll probably maybe, I'm breaking, I, yeah, I should have taken that without any question. So what I'll probably do is increase, put several chests around here. Um, And then have, you know, look at the sea, have all the different chests. So Feather Falling 4. So just, ooh, Looting 3 book. I would like that. <laughs> We're still at over 100. So as far as doing any type of just random enchants on my gear, I think I'm good to... Uh, you know, should be pretty good on on just doing my own gear. Wow, I'm getting Bane's way too much. You know what? I will save room for that. Let's come back up here, and we're still not even through. I already AFK'd once and I did tons of uh, enchants. So if we look, and the reason why I'm just throw, randomly throwing them, so we got three full chests. That one's almost full. That one's almost full. That one's got some room. That one's got a little bit of room. So my chests are filling up pretty fast with a bunch of enchants. Feather Fallen, Awkward Infinity. Sharpness, glass protection, feather falling three. I'd rather have that, I guess. Sharpness, yeah. Projectile, protection, good. Hmm. I got tons of Aqua, in, Aqua Infinity books, but I'll take one more. Eighty-one. Leading two. Mm, sharpness three. Sixty-nine, sixty-six. Protection four. Silk touch, definitely. That's two silk touch books I have. That's not not bad at all. But a fallen four. Power three. 51 almost done and I do apologize didn't know if y'all would want to see this on camera or not but when I wanted to at least show off my levels because that um dang bane of arc arthropods some of these things I'm just won't ever use I mean and out of lapis that is all my lapis look at that so I, I did run out of lapis before levels and exactly 30 levels. So this is what 246 levels give you, I think. Besides counting what I had, almost six solid, complete chests filled with books. So yeah, okay. So I went ahead and did a little bit more work over here. 
I I wanted to change having the white beacon, so I changed them to black, and I, I kind of like that. So let me know what you think about the beacon color. So I put, went ahead and I just put some black glass there. You may notice, here's my farm. Uh, I think looks looks pretty good. Um, so I did do something something kind of fancy on this side. Had uh, Flim come over here, help me out, because I haven't really done a lot with these blocks. So if we run up here, we can jump up and get up nicely, and, and it still keeps the flush side. Um, and same type of path area. I need to do something in this area. Um, but this episode, I'm probably going to be working on my portal. Uh, I would figured I would have already been started by now, uh, my portal area. However, that enchanting, wow. Uh, that's the most levels I've ever seen. Then again, I haven't built a slime farm like that. So for those of you who didn't catch my last episode, go check it out for this uh, cow farm. Um, basically hit the button. Oh, let me go get some wheat. And actually, let me kill them first because I do have... I do have some already grown down there, so yeah, let me kill these guys. And I'm getting picking up some of the stuff. So this is not the best design, you know, I know. Um, so, you know, you may say it, I didn't get too many comments on my last video of people, you know, on, on this design. But if you can't reach them, push the water. It's going to push everything, including the drops. Drops go in those pistons below those pressure plates. As we kill to take out the cows. So now we can turn that back off. Water goes down. We got stuff in there. Stuff in there. It's, in, it's going to slowly go through there. So leather's not a problem. That's why I went ahead and made so many books to come up here. And now we need to breed them again. So we have, there's a good, I mean, I've used almost a full stack. So, I mean, it hit the button, water pushes up, they start bobbing up and down, and now we can just go to town, doing some breeding, making the babies. So as you can see, already a stack, still going strong. Nineteen, eighteen, sixteen, doing good. Fifteen, fourteen. So you can see fifty right there. Um, it's only fourteen, thirteen. Yeah, I think that's gonna be getting close to it. But let me turn that back off. They all drop back down in in spot, and now we got our little little ones down there that we can. Wait to get nice and big and then send them to the slaughter. So, you know what? I already got a bunch of cow stuff over here. My, I still got to rethink my sorting system. I, I'm kind of wishing I did something like Flim's doing. If you've seen his latest video, he did uh, more in depth of it. He's got it's just a massive, massive uh, sorting system. So, uh, um, take those out. Mm, uh, food. So I do have plenty of food, so it's not like I need to smelt this stuff up. Oh, some interesting lag. But uh, okay, that should drop everything down. Yeah. So she watches, being spied on. So, uh, what to do today? I'm going to go ahead and what I had plans for this, and I may have mentioned it kind of already, but uh, I need to play around with different ideas. You know, <laughs> Flynn was over here, and, you know, I'm sitting here thinking, I was like, okay, well, I want to move my portals up to this level. And then I'm going to have four paths going off, you know, to that path, walkway, you know, same type of cobblestone thing, uh, or, you know, cobble, gravel. And I'm going to have a path going out there, maybe put another build in this area, then something else over here. And then this path would kind of go off to the fish, auto fisher, 
wood room for you know a couple other builds and things and uh you know and then this would kind of break away to build this over here well and then he was like oh yeah kind of like spawn set up and i was like oh <laughs> it's like i completely forgot that that's exactly how spawn is set up uh you know except there's a big building around the spawn and i don't necessarily want to do that because i was planning on putting like planners and stuff in the four you know in between the four quadrants so i have uh you know, I didn't want to do it exactly like that, so like, you know, like I was copying spawn because I thought it would look cool, and then I was like, crap, it's used. So I could still do it. I mean, you know, uh, Code did a great job on that, so I could do it on this. But um, I'm going to try to play around some with some more ideas. Um, this I definitely want sloped down because this pathing area is nice, and all this is looks pretty good, but it's all flat. So I really need to start adding some texture, and that's what I wanted to do in this area. Uh, you know, is add a little, little height. And then the other thing is, I think you know, just coming out of the portal and looking down the hill in different directions at, you know, this over here and and the slaughterhouse, uh, a little hobbit hole back there. You know, my farming area in there. I mean. I think being up here and then looking down just makes sense for this build. So I'm going to stop rambling on. I'm going to try to get some progress done and then I will be right back. We are back and I've made some progress and it is the next day. <laughs> uh, yeah. So took a little bit of break. I started working on a couple other series that I'm working on that, uh, already seen and I came back to do some uh, some work on here I may actually try to replace those with half slabs of glass since I did that up, up top there I, I kind of like that um, yeah so if we come through here can take a look at what I've been working on and yep so I completely ran out of gravel so I need to find more for this so I can do the floor in here but there's the portal room. So, got some random things out here. Went ahead and filled in all the grassy, grassy areas. It's gonna say grassy bits. <laughs> uh, so, it's kind of busy, and I'm not a hundred percent sure on it. Um, but I, I notice I say that about a lot of stuff. Um, I guess starting here, I went ahead and put some some jungle wood and get some uh, coca beans growing in a couple spots just add a little texture I don't really care for these yellow flowers I was putting bone meal down and then breaking some grass but they had tons of these flowers and yeah I'm not a big fan of them so uh, that's that and so I put some regular grass in there we got the large trees man you don't get much saplings for cutting down these trees, man. I had to cut down so many just to get uh, more saplings to plant. And um, so I actually went and tried to track some down. So this area, pretty open. I added some extra little flowers in here. You notice um, just the detail on here. Tried to make it look the best I could and then so I didn't do this path over here or this path. So I still wanted to, to work on some, some stuff. But this actually filled in nicely, this area. Um, okay, well, I'm, you know, me and my par... <laughs> that was just pitiful. Um, parkour skills. So I went ahead and filled in this area. So I tried to make it not busy, but not busy. Um, some of this wheat still needs to grow, um, and I was going to get some bone meal for that last tree over there. So I don't know, I don't remember if I sh no, yeah, I showed that off. Um, but yeah, I got the path that comes down here. I tried to put some grass in between it, kind of, you know, looks like it goes both ways. Uh, we got the cow farm area, I got some... You know, good fresh uh, pork, not pork, beef. Why is that not going down in the hopper? Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay. Um, got that. We can come up here. Breed them. Saw that. Went ahead and added a few more things, like some vines. But look at the view from up here. Um, really like how that turned out. The path, everything. Got this in the background. Got the, you know, the woodsy area. And that's what I wanted to do. I mean, this is an open mushroom island, basically. But I don't want it to be. And that's what I'm going for. It's more of a island, jungle island type. Not really jungle, I should say. Just dense island. And uh, so, yeah. So that is pretty much the portal room. I'm probably going to go ahead and... Uh, I've been doing quite a bit of off-camera work. Um, so I wanted to show this off. And just let me know what you think. You know, do you like this? Um, this structure, you know, with the path. I... I think it turned out um, about as what I, I need to stop trying that. I keep failing. Oh my gosh, I'm bad. Um, I think it turned out pretty good. And also do some suggestions. Um, you know, if you have any suggestions about what I should build next, I need to get a place around this farm area, so I need to come up with that. Even though I don't really use this too much, I was thinking about it, and I mean, I got my name tags. And you know, I got plenty of puffer fish. I got, you know, some books here. Um, pretty good, but books. <laughs> I don't have an issue with books. I got tons of them. Um, so I wanted to, you know, of course this tree needs to grow or I could bone meal it. Um, so I wanted to do, this path is going to at least come out to this building here. And I wanted to break off to another farm. So what I'm probably going to do maybe next episode or one of the episodes at least is make a bunch of signs kind of like you may have seen me do before um, and probably do a wall of progress I guess I could call it so um, the only other things I have on my agenda that I w really want to do is my uh, my beacon area um, Get those set up as an as a you know y'all know from the other is i have plenty of gold for two more beacon um even though i only have one more beacon i have i have one still over at the the guardian farm um but i'm probably going to set one up over here and one up over there and then i have may have one that i can just move uh, around randomly to take out all of that so um the beacon area you know fixing that up is one of, is on my list of stuff to do um, building around that but other than that that's about it <laughs> getting so tired bad um, so yeah so I know I need to make the sugarcane farm the other melon farm maybe maybe I'll do something with that um, and I do kind of feel bad I'm all uh, overshot it um, I'm all out here kind of on my own, um, you know, and I probably should try to do a little bit more in town. So I may, may need to try to think of another shop or another build or something. But um, that's what it looks like from here. This hole I really want to move and do something with. I don't want that like that. I may try to do an area directly down. Well, hello, Mr. Uh, Enderman. Um, may... oh. Come at me. So, I could you do something where, you know, cave system down here. Um, I don't know yet. But, anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed. Uh, so, this what my little... Um, portal area and you know just uh, let me know what I should do next says so anyway this has been Kenema and I'll talk to y'all later